Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. On today's vlog, well, today's vlog, today we are going to vlog about, today, today we are going to the Trevi Fountain. We're, this is our last day in Rome. We're in Rome for, we were in Rome for two nights. Um, reason being because we're going to go to Florence. We're going to be there for how many nights? We're staying in Florence for four nights. Oh, we're staying in Florence for four nights, and then we're going to Cinque Terre for two, two nights. nights. So we're going to be in Florence longer. That's where we're going to be spending Christmas. We're really excited about that because we're going to take a cooking class, which I'll show you in the cooking class. But today is on Rome. Yesterday we spent the day here. We saw the Colosseum. However, my camera was being silly. The lens was just not working for some reason it just kept saying lens not detected although there was a lens there uh because a few months ago i did drop my camera and like the lens part of the the like the lens like the what's it called this thing right here it fell out and so i think it was because of that because it makes this weird noise every time i turn it on but i mean it still works camera quality is good so that's okay but that's why it wasn't working yesterday hence the reason why i couldn't vlog yesterday's day but it was a very beautiful day. We saw the Colosseum. We had pasta and um, espresso. Also espresso. We are at our Airbnb in Rome, obviously. Uh, it's a very nice flat. I won't show you guys how it looks, only because it's a really messy. Um, uh, because we haven't cleaned it. But it would have been nice if I showed you when we got here because. It was just, it, it was just really beautiful. There, it's just, there's a bathtub, it, it just, a, a jacuzzi, a hot tub, sorry. But it's very messy right now, so I won't show you guys. But um, this is our view from the, um, the Airbnb. And uh, eh, there's really not much. <laughs> but we are really close to the metro, and so that's a plus because we are commuting our way through. We are commuting to everything. We're commuting to every destination because uh, it saves us money and it's also fun. Um, the bus is free as long as you go in through the back. And <laughs> it's very overcrowded though. Um, but I will show you guys that. I'll talk to you guys about that maybe later. Maybe I won't even mention it. It's just, it's very fun to commute here, especially through the bus. Um, but yeah, so let's get the day started. the most amazing vegan burgers it's a restaurant called flower burger and the service was great right? service it was, was great. amazing it was amazing and the burgers were so good there was like there were like these colored burgers the place was just so awesome and we didn't really get a picture of the burgers before eating them because we were just so stoked to eat it so we just like kind of like dug in and we were hungry because it was lunchtime so how did you like the burger strongly recommend strongly recommend we are going to put the link for the restaurant down there um, they are in different places uh, definitely a European restaurant but maybe you can check it out when you're somewhere else um, Daniel just finished juggling water bottles he's very good at it we like to show everyone oh. um, where are we going we're going to brain fart Vatican St. Peter's Basilica we have arrived to the Vatican. It's very beautiful. It is a very beautiful sunny day. So beautiful and sunny. You'd think that it'd be gloomy because it is mid-December, but it is so beautiful and sunny. Look at how beautiful and sunny. it's almost like the sun is just hitting right here in the middle. It's like the sun is like we must only be on top of the Vatican and that is that's exactly what's happening. It's so beautiful. And it's not a really busy day today, huh honey? Doesn't look like it. No baby. Beautiful. Daniel has been here before. And he said that it's always really busy. Is this how busy it was last time you were here? No, not even remotely. It was extremely busy. Daniel was here in the summer, about like six months ago. Mm -hmm. Somewhere in June? That's right. Yeah. June. I remember seeing lines forming. 
from the very, very, very beginning of the entrance to as far as you can see over there. Yeah, so we are really lucky that today's not a busy day. It's also a weekday, it's a Friday. Maybe that's why. And uh, there's, um, I don't know if you can see that, but that is made out of uh, sand, arena. It's made out of sand. If you can see it, I'm saying then. Yeah. Eugene. Yes, Father? Eugene, I have food for you. Where is the food, you say? <laughs> I am about to try tiramisu for the very first time. Daniel has had tiramisu before because Daniel was here six months ago without me. Unfortunate. But we're trying tiramisu. Uh, okay, first reactions to uh, tiramisu. What is tiramisu exactly? I will tell you what I know. I don't Are know. Are you recording me? Mm -hmm. It's very delicious. You try it. Have you had tiramisu from this place? Mm -hmm. No. Oh. From Rome, yes. Like that place. Like kind of, it's kind of, the texture of it is kind of like flan, but kind of like pudding. That's exactly how Daniel described it to me. Yeah. When he said that we should try tiramisu. And it very much is that exactly. <laughs> There's no other way to explain it but flan <coughs> and pudding together. <laughs> you might choke, side effect. Very delicious, 10, 10. It was only 350, right? Three euros and fifty cents. That cents? Yep. Three euros and fifty cents. No, three. Oh, fifty euro cents. Fifty euro cents. So you must come here and try tiramisu. Or else, like you never went to Rome. We are at the Chevy Fountain. We finally made it. There is tons of people here. It's definitely very hard to get a picture. You will either be in somebody's picture or somebody will be in your picture, which they will, then they will ask you politely to get out of the way or they probably might just stare at you vigorously and uh, hope that you'll move out of the way. Like me. Like Daniel, he does this vigorous stare until they move and then I have to come in and be like, it's okay, it comes down. Um, I believe this is a fountain where uh, is it Reese with this ring? I don't know, she's blonde. And when in Rome, she makes a wish. She puts coin into the fountain and she wishes for love. And I think that's how she meets in her life. I'm not sure, correct me if I'm wrong. However, we are here and it's beautiful. <laughs> Loving you is like waiting for the rain. 